بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم ألم نشرح لك صدرك ووضعنا عنك وزرك الذي أنقض ظهرك ورفعنا لك ذكرك فإن مع العسر يسرا إن مع العسر يسرا فإذا فرغت فانصب وإلى ربك فارغب It's about two years that you have graduated. I know it's very hard finding a good job. But you don't give up. But have faith. Don't give up. You never listen to me. What will you do when we are gone? You won't be here forever. Good luck. Good luck finding a wife. The park bench was deserted as I sat down to breathe beneath the straggly branches of an old evergreen. Disillusioned by life, with good reason to frown, for the world was intent on dragging me down. And if that weren't enough to ruin my day, from thin air sprang a child all tired from play. He stood right before me with his head tilted down and said with great excitement, Sir, look what I found. In his hand was a flower, and what a pitiful sight. Not enough rain or maybe too little light. Wanting him to take it and go off to play, I faked a little smile then shifted away. But instead of retreating, he sat by my side, placed the flower to his nose, then declared with surprise, it sure smells pretty and it's beautiful too. That's why I picked it, sir. Here, it's for you. The sickly weed before me was either dying or dead, show not of vibrant colors, neither orange nor red. But I knew I must take it, or he might never leave, so I reached for the flower and replied, just what I need. But instead of him placing the flower in hand, he held it in midair, without reason no plan. It was then that I noticed for the very first time, the weed-toting boy could not see, he was blind. I heard my voice quiver and tears shone in the sun as I thanked him for picking the very best one. You're welcome, he replied, and then ran off to play, unaware of the impact he had on my day. I sat there and wondered how he managed to see a self-pitying person beneath an old evergreen. How did he know of my self-indulged plight? Perhaps from his heart he had been blessed with true sight. Through the eyes of a blind child, at last I could see. My problem with the world, alas, was with me. And for all those times, I myself had been blind. I vowed to appreciate every second that's mine. Then I held that wilted flower up to my nose and breathed in its fragrance, that of a red rose. Then smiled as I watched that lad, another weed in his hand about to change the life of an unexpecting old man. Baba, guess what happened at school today? What happened at school? The teacher said that one day I'll have my own family. Well, oh, of course you will. I want a big family with a big house and a bathroom inside. 
Oh, mm, that's cool. I want a job tasting candy and marry a beautiful girl, just like Mom. Inshallah, after you graduate, you probably will.